the Lions have thrown in a couple of spots here you'd expect them to run. They do again, St. Brown, who pitches it back to Swift, who's on the run. Swift inside the 20 to the 17-yard line. <laughs> you talk about letting it all hang out. Oh, my goodness. Oh, the two-minute warning. Are you kidding me? If the Lions get three yards, the Packers will get knocked out of the playoffs. <laughs> From knocking the Packers out of the playoffs and letting Seattle in the 45 yard line. They're going to go to the air. Goff throws and it is. Is it caught? Is it held on to? Incomplete. Ruled incomplete as Amon Ross St. Brown was coming across. They'll bring up second down. Let's peek at the back end of it. Wait a minute. They've had a conversation amongst the officials. They say catch. Did it never hit the ground? It got tied up in his leg. Oh my goodness. It was between his legs. He definitely drops it, but does it land in his lap and never touch the ground? And then he gains control of it late. Wow. I, <laughs> not on the ground, not on the ground, not on the ground. Somebody has to come away with it, and it is St. Brown. Now, I've seen seasons in a lot of weird ways. Anticipates and finds Wilson, who breaks tackles. Garrett Wilson still going. Down to the 25-yard line, 43 yards. Biggest play of the day comes from the rookie. And the long run of the day for Kenneth Walker, 15 yards. Gets Seattle a first down. Two times in a row, they've lined up with him offset. Smith looking for the end zone and Lockett. Oh, what and he ball. drops it in. Tyler Lockett with the touchdown. Are you kidding me? A pinpoint pass from Geno Smith and Seattle. A chance to tie it up. What a throw. The Revolutions on that football. That thing was tight, man. The team that controls it at the moment. If it wins, Jones to Parker. Reaches up. What a catch. Touchdown, New England. Wow, this is what I was talking about earlier, Jim. Just don't overthrow. It's one-on-one -on -one out there. The corner's not looking back at you. Drink. Anthony Brown. Look out! Hendrickson. Ball's loose. It is. Reader got it. Vacuums it in. Touchdown, Cincinnati. Hendrickson coughed it up with a big hit. Reader gobbles it in. It's the third turnover by Baltimore. And the third touchdown off a turnover. They can win on defense. They can run the football, and they're getting the ball down the field now. Red zone's big, though. Second and goal. And fake again. Play action. Back of the end zone. Myers. Did he get the second foot down? I'm not sure he did. This is close. Oh, wait. I saw that one, but did the right one touch? If the right foot touched, he's in. Was the right foot down it's when he It's right had, here. The right cause... foot right there. Did that touch? Oh, man, I think he did. did. That was he's beautiful. In. Oh, my goodness. He that's tapped it. Look at this. Look at this. Right there. Oh. Is there contact with the ground? <laughs> I'm not really sure. But we do have super high def, incredible camera people who get everything great. Yeah, it had to have. Otherwise, how do you spring so, up in the air like that? It's great play by Jacoby Myers. 145 left. Giants have no timeouts remaining. Webb is going to take a shot to the end zone. Oh, what a grab! Kenny Galladay, touchdown, Giants! Against Darius Slay, his former teammate in Detroit. And a case could be made that Slay had enveloped him and wrapped him up, and Galladay goes up with one arm. Look how Slay's got him wrapped right there, got a hand on him, no flag. But Galladay, one hand, then brings the second one in. Colts playing their ultra prevent defense on fourth and 20. Mills. Buying some time, fires towards the end zone, and it is caught! Oh my word. Improbable! Akins! 
It went right through his hands. I thought it was an interception. He takes that all the way untouched. Four-man rush. Prescott, that one might be a pick six. It will be. Touchdown, Washington. Do you believe that? You're going to see they just run a little speed out here to the, out to the wide side of the field, and he squats and just jumps it. He sees that coming from depth the entire time, and back-to-back turnover-worthy plays. You see Noah Brown. They just call that a speed out. It's just going to round that five, six yards out. Ellinger from the gun as they play down three points. Ellinger, boy, trying to somehow escape that pass. is picked off. Intercepted. Jonathan Grenard in for the pick six. Wow. Dobbs is hit from behind. The ball's out. They're calling this a fumble at the moment. And the return by Allen for the touchdown. Jenkins hit Dobbs. And for now, it's a touchdown. More recently with the Lions. Cooper back to Blau. Deep downfield for Green. And he catches it. A.J. Green will take it all the way into the end zone. And that is a Cardinals touchdown. Well, A.J. Green's going to be lined up over here. And you're going to see... The action moving across there with the fake sweep. And he gets it back there to Blau. And Blau knows he's going to be taking a big shot there from S Samson at Bootcom. And A.J. Green just went up and fought for it. And this is what David Blau said. He said, I'm going to give you some chances to go up and fight. Have been in control of that game throughout. Again, Cincinnati could move up to the two. And Buffalo could fall back to the three if the Bills lose here. Cincinnati goes on to a win, which you might expect. Baltimore shorthanded. Here comes Hines again. Oh my goodness! Can he do it twice? Is this for real? Can you believe it? Even a little Dion strut to the end zone. 101 yards. And wow. Watch him bounce off the tackle. Right here. That was where it was like. He bounced right off of Miles Bryant. It's just so hard to describe. I mean, it's just. That was almost easy. <laughs> They're not easy, but at the same time, it was like a little stiff arm that says goodbye, and it's not even like you're there, and it was just going to happen. And I know this is your time. You'd like to keep us updated. Yeah, we'll keep everybody posted on Pittsburgh and Cleveland. Miami and the Jets were underway as New England decided to defer after winning the toss. And here's Hines on the run back, breaking a tackle and taking it past midfield. And down the sideline he goes. This is storybook. An opening kickoff return for Tamar Hamlin. And this place is absolutely going wild. Guys, through the week, the positivity, the game's going to be played. How will it go? And Hines breaks it. 96 yards for a touchdown. You think he just allowed everyone to take a deep breath on the Buffalo sideline? Right there. You come out, and you know one of the hardest things is how are they going to handle the early portion of this game, Jim? I think they did okay. I, I'm, I'm, I don't believe what we just saw here.